Hello, this video is going to show you how to clean up data uh, using R and the more specifically the fill function and the distinct function. Well, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to call the libraries we need. So this uh, the data is going to be in Excel, so we're going to use the read Excel package, the tidy R package, which we need for the fill function, and the dplyr R package. Uh, which will have the distinct function. Alright, so go ahead and bring in the data, view it. So as you can see the data here, uh, we have stats for James Harden and LeBron James. And you can see here the way the data is set up, there's a lot of NAs. So we want to have a flat file uh, in order to do some data cleanup. Uh, we want to get rid of those NAs by filling in James Harden all the way down and then same thing for LeBron James having LeBron James all the way down and as you can see down here you have uh, duplicate rows think about eight or nine duplicate rows so we'd want to get rid of those uh, in a fast and easy way so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna do DF right which is the name of the data and then we're just going to apply it the fill function to the column player. As you can see now, James Harden, the, the player name, goes all the way down up until LeBron James. And it goes all the way down. And the second thing we need to clean up, we have uh, about nine rows for the 2019 and two to 2020 season. So in order to get rid of uh, the duplicate rows, because you could have in another situation you could possibly have thousands of rows, uh, so it's not it's not easy to, to go through Excel and do them all, you know, go one by one to see which ones are, um, are duplicates. So we could go here, so we'll bring in the DF1 data, right? And we'll apply the distinct function that's coming from the using the deep deploy R package. So we'll run that. And let's look at that data. If you see down here, now you only have one row with the 2019-2020 season. All right, and I will. Um, include uh, the documentation that comes with these two functions. I'll uh, put them down in the uh, description below. Uh, if you found this video helpful, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, thank you.